Hi friends, I am speaking your friend Prabhupada. In this video, I am telling about how to set the error validation to each text box and then how to set the error provided in this .NET. Okay, okay. In this the .NET project of the error providing, I am show you to. Now, I am just run it. This project, I am already creating this project. And, uh, now I am telling about already the how to set the dynamic date time and then progress bar and then how to set the insert delete update the data from the database okay it have so many concept i'm told to you uh, my tutorial um, okay in this place i am telling about how to set the error provided to each text box the validation when are clicking the save the empty data are not save okay see i'm just i'm saving there is Save means the data save. Okay, I'm going to view it. So in data save, the empty data also save in this database. See, the empty data is also save. Again also I'm clicking. Again also save. Okay, I'm de just declaring here uh, some data. Okay, twelve. Okay, just to save it see the so many text box empty but the data save okay this time view click and then see again also told save so to you the 12th uh, data empty at fill in this place okay when i clicking the save the time that not save uh, the empty data so okay when i filling the text box each text box that time only the data save okay so I am declaring the error provided to each text box. How it's set? Okay. Now first I am goes to that design page. Okay. Goes to design. Now I am declaring in this place the first goes to toolbox and then open the toolbox in this place uh, error provider. See it goes to the toolbox of error provider available here. Okay. Just go and drag and drop in this place okay the error provided uh, drag and drop in this place first just clicking to this error provider and just view code the text change okay whenever the save button click the time the error show empty text box should be show okay the error provided show uh, to the empty text box so i am declaring the save button and uh, saving the time the show error okay so i'm just goes to click in this place the connection in this place i'm declaring error provider error provider dot clear okay first of all you should clear though each uh, error should not known okay so uh, now just run it not having error to each text box okay just goes to in this place error yeah, provider one dot clear why i am declaring error provider one means see i am declaring in this place error provider one so i am declaring all in this place error provider one and then see the button the save button one see the button one when i click in the save that time the double click the save button the event to open the save query and then in this place i am declaring after the error provider clear and then if condition to each text box i am declaring in this place text box one the text <coughs> sorry sorry friends and then text box one dot length less than equal to zero okay less than equal to zero or zero above to zero means the text box uh, set the error okay and just open bracket and then close bracket between these error provider one dot 
I have provided dot set dot set here I have provided one dot set error okay set error bracket open and close please and declaring the text error definition okay please fill id okay control s and then finish it control s okay and set to the error in this place the text box 2 okay between in from before i am declaring the text box 2 comma please fill id okay why i am declaring the text box 2 means the text box not uh, adding error so the text box having error so the text box not go to the error or another cursor goes to the another text box so i am declaring this one so i am going to the run it and then open this um, project just not having the text so I am declaring now I am enter and save it. See the error provided show on the text box two. Okay, the error provided show on the text box two. So I am declaring the text box one means one means control s again I am fill uh, run it now I am declaring save clicking the save see the first one not declare so the one seen on the place ok the error provider showing ok ok I am goes to clicking in this place one control s just to go to click run it now I am clicking save button the error provided show and then save also completed why means see the number of data save why means uh, it's available the zero I am declaring C0 so I am it's open see in this place we should declare the condition open and close and declaring in this place else if else if drag it open and then just copy and paste this one control c and then declaring control v ok control s in this place I am declaring text box 2 and then also text box sorry I will put one and then here text box 2 control S here the name text box 2 means name so name available within uh, 2 ok the 2 name 2 letters also available the name ra and then anyone okay i am declaring also three okay control s rom the three three letter above three three above three okay the available means the error not show in this place okay just cancel control s 
now uh, again also this one copy and then paste control c and then declare control v this one combo box this one also three text box not the combo box combo box combo box dot text dot length less than equal to four one means male available four letter and then female available five letters so I am declaring four the text box the combo box I am declaring the control C and then declaring control V control S okay and then this one also control C and then declaring in this place control V and then again also control V I mean this text box 4 and then also this one 4 the fourth text box uh, mobile number so should be 10 number only available so uh, equal to 10 ok control s equal to equal to 10 ok and then age should be single character or double character ok so I am declaring the single character so I am using one control s ok and in this place this text box 3 and then this one also 3 control s the cursor control x cut and then declare in this place control v control s ok this error correct means the data should be saved the correct error not the correct means the data is not saved in this place so I am going to run it see I am just save it the error providing so see please fill id so in the uh, error I am um, go to declaring the cursor put on the error button so the error showing in this place again I am declaring in this place 13 now click save the error move to second one text box so I am declaring in this place uh, I am declaring to this name three characters so I am just three or three above three if you are declaring two means the again also show error in this place ok I am declaring third one means uh, ROM ok ROM means and save it the error move to 3 ok at uh, this I am declaring 4 ok I am declaring the Raman Raman ok file address declared so just uh, save the cursor move to another place ok the validation fixed fit to the each uh, provider ok the each text box so uh, here declaring mail the 4 letter available so I am declaring 4 and then save it the cursor move to another one Four above four. Okay, I'm going to declaring this one in this place. Comma box zero to four. The file level five is available. So I'm going to clicking three. Three means zero to three. This one two. Control S. See the same the same message. I'm fill to the each error provider so I am just uh, change the uh, uh, information to the each text box ok I am just filling fill second one is the name so fill name I am declaring in this place please fill gender and then in this place please fill mobile and then also in this place h control s ok i am set to each error provider say i am running the condition worked in this place just goes to now the data save the error provider showing the message 
please fill id so i am declaring please that in i am de declaring so again save click the name asking so in this provider i am declaring please fill name okay i am declaring name uh, rom okay the two i am declaring the error code so it goes to that one and in this place gentar okay please press gentar showing the message and then goes to mail filling and then save i and click error provider goes to that uh, saved successfully i means the i am declaring the message to each uh, text box so how it's filling means i am declaring the numbers only less than 10 means see i am declaring here less than 10 less than 10 means the data are not saved okay just goes to run it here declaring 13 save error uh, showing and then declaring rom and then save goes to another error provider and declaring mail and click on fourth one mobile number above above 10 means it's work okay so i can also show in this place just clicking about 10 and then the custom mode uh, error provider show on the uh, another one and then also show in this place just click h 13 and then save not having in the error in this place the data is also save see save the message show on the face the 13th and then type in the h available so just view the data save in this place see rom and 13 13 in this place okay and goes to declaring in this place to control s uh, one equal control s this one is a text box 3 yeah and then goes to save the data means if you want to save the data means error provider and then again also 5 5 repeat 5 data and then any name and then click also here gender and female union and then also clicking the mobile number see the data error provider showing on the place and then in this place okay set in this place save then after save it just goes to that form and then in this place control closed closing and then it is control and closing okay now it's function I can also see each time that I'm show to you each error what happened in this place okay I'm uh, recent carefully I'm told to each time okay and then declare again again also in this place enter mail and then again also here and then please fill and then save it the data save okay okay friends I am told to you how to set the error provided to the each text box okay uh, if you have any doubt to in this see the uh, last field also save in this place okay the 32 and then each one okay save in this place okay friends if you have any doubt on any having in this concept another another concept also you want to learn means just command and message to my uh, mail id and then after to do that okay uh, if you want any doubt means if you have any doubt and any concept means just comment to me and then subscribe me thank you friends bye i am told to another concept in another video have a nice day